Hello everyone, welcome to my Fab Life channel. My name is Ty Brown. You're really welcome here. This is Coco Brown. She's decided to join us today. Um, I don't know how long that will last, so we'll have to see. That's it. You get nice and comfy, Coco. I have got a super chill, super relaxed Amazon haul for you today. It's really showcasing some of my Amazon favorites and things that I buy time and time again. So if that sounds like something you'd like to watch, then stay tuned. So all the links will be down in the description box. You can just click that open. Prices as well will be in the description box or on the screen. So we're going to get started with the decor home pieces. I'm just going to get started with some of the books that I've been buying from Amazon. I'm not going to lie, some just to make my house look cute. I'll start with the biggest of the books, which is the White Company for the Love of White. It actually has some really, really cute pictures and cute ideas in there. So it's actually worth flicking through and not just using it purely for decorative purposes. The other two books that I got for decorative purposes are both about Chanel and they are in that nice monochrome look. I'm sure some of you have seen these books before. The first is The Illustrated World of Fashion by Megan Hess. It's got lots of images and cute little pictures. Really, if you like her illustrations, then you're going to like this book. And on top of that, I usually lay this book because it's slightly smaller. And this is The Little Book of Chanel by Emma Baxter Wright. But honestly, I just love the way the two go hand in hand. I like to put something like uh, some reed diffusers on top of that. Now, the other two books I have are actually for reading. The first is Becoming Michelle Obama. So this book obviously is about the former first First Lady's um, life and really documenting her life. I haven't finished, I haven't even quite got halfway through, but I do like it and it's nice to see some of the events, if you like, and the people that shaped a life like hers. The other book which I have mentioned on this channel before is The Secret. I know I'm not going to explain it quite so well, but, um, but it's really all focused on the law of attraction and using the law of attraction to bring positive things into your life. Still in the topic of decor is a beautiful item which is not here because it's too big and it's actually down in the lounge. And of course, I'm talking about my beautiful feather lamp, which I absolutely love. It feels a little bit cluttered because it's wedged between the bookshelf and my husband's little fish tank. So it's just not quite working there. I'm still trying to figure out where to put it. And finally, when it comes to decor, is a grey and white basket. This one is actually from H&M, but at the time when the H&M one was sold out, I was looking for a replacement. But the Amazon ones are great dupes for these. They have grey and white ones, they have other colour schemes. Obviously, my house is more of a grey and white colour scheme. I'm happy to link this exact one, but I think this is now sold out. So do check out the Amazon ones as well. Moving on to beauty, one of the things that I'm loving at the moment is this vanity mirror this vanity mirror also came in a white i can't remember what other colors possibly a gray as well but i do particularly like this one because it's got different magnifications um so it's great if you want to be a little bit more up close when you're doing your makeup for example and you can adjust how dim or how bright those lights are so i really do like that if you are someone who does a lot of makeup tutorials then something like this is a great and inexpensive way of adding good lighting now something that i got during lockdown was my gel nail kit this kit i think was 35.99 so depending on how often you use it it's going to end up being great cost per wear or cost per use the reason i particularly like this one is it came with everything that you would need including things like nail files i did mention in one of my other videos that i never do my nails at home i didn't even have a nail file at home i didn't have nail clippers at home so i was so pleased to receive this nail kit during lockdown when it eventually arrived honestly partly for basic things like the nail file and of course it comes with the usual things that you would expect like the base coat and the top coat and of course a ton of nail polish colors let's just move in a little bit deeper into skincare i usually pick up a lot of my the ordinary products from amazon so the three ordinary products that i bought recently are the vitamin c suspension 23 percent so because this contains vitamin C, it's great for um, targeting uneven skin tone and trying to make your skin tone a little bit more even, a little bit more balanced. Um, then I also got the retinol. This one I haven't used quite as much because it is so, 
super oily. Retinol is great for um, signs of aging. I don't particularly feel like I have a lot of signs of aging yet. So I probably don't go for it quite as much. The other thing I picked up, which I love, is the Ordinary Niacinamide with Zinc. This is great for just giving your skin that injection of moisture the final ordinary product now this one actually isn't from amazon but i wanted to show you and that is the famous glycolic acid toner it's the sort of thing i look at for every time i'm doing an amazon order and if it is available then i'll just chuck it into my basket and if it's not you know then we just keep it moving and the last product that i did get from amazon is paula's choice 2% BHA, I'm sure everybody, I'm sure you guys all know about Paula's Choice. But salicylic acid, of course, is great for unclogging your pores and shrinking your pores. It's great, again, for that creating that smoother tone. So if you have uneven tone. Now, moving on to hair products, I buy a ton of hair products from Amazon. I obviously can't show them all. I actually created this look today on a YouTube video. This is my high ponytail um, look for the summer. It's using a ponytail extension from my hair company, Fabulous hair I'll link that down below quick plug um, so I'll show you the tools and the products that I have because I just use them for this look so I actually have them to hand the first is my usual go-to every single day hair moisturizer which is the olive oil ORS hair moisturizer um, and I do when I've run out of that I do actually use instead the care hair oil moisturizer then of course you know that we're gonna feature our got to be glue products which I always buy from Amazon so this is the the freezing spray and then I have both the gels but I only use this black one on today's look my hair is fairly fine anyway so when I brush it down it stays down I mean there's not much of it anyway so it stays pretty slick which is a good thing if you're trying to recreate this hairstyle which means that I only needed a little bit for the back but I did feature it in the video but what I do use all over my hair is the Kera Care styling wax this is also good for those flyaways at your neck as well this is like my go-to hair wax the other thing I use on my roots to create this super sleek look these are the double-ended ones so it's got a comb on one end and then the hairbrush on the other i think i bought this as a set of three so it came in a black a blue and a purple i used the purple to, in today's video to create this hairstyle but i thought i would show you the blue one because it's still nice and clean in its package the other hair tool that i love and i would highly recommend from amazon is the wall straightening comb absolutely essential if you are trying to create more of a lifted root in your hair or in your wig to create that slight bump and therefore that a little bit more volume in your look now moving on to the final section which is to do with youtube and things that i use on youtube whether it's tools and so on the first is my productivity planner i have this beautiful pink productivity planner please excuse the front because my three-year-old has drawn on it there so um i love this productivity planner there are a ton of productivity planners out there but i highly highly recommend this one the reason i love it is because most of the book is an actual daily planner and then at the end of the week so once you've gone through seven daily planners it then has this reflection on last week but it still has planners for the month and for goals for the future 10 year goal five year goals that's sort of thing. the other thing that i use every single time i'm doing youtube which you cannot see right now is because it is in use right now is my tripod so i actually use a tripod come selfie stick i do particularly like this one because it comes with its own bluetooth enabled uh, remote so when i'm ready to start filming i can just click on it or when i'm ready to take pictures it works for taking pictures as well as filming videos another item that has become an absolute lifesaver is my external hard drive this is the toshiba um one tetra Ooh, bless you coco you okay this is the toshiba one tetrabyte external hard drive um since doing youtube i have just been running out of space all the time on my phone on my laptop so this is something that everyone should have now something else that i would highly recommend if you're doing a youtube video is a microphone this is my microphone and it's super duper long the wire is so long so it's great i don't always like using a microphone if i'm wearing something darker then i will wear it because i find the dark colors will conceal the microphone more um but it's a great microphone to use this is the boyer 
bigger microphone and this works with smartphones as well on as well as on cameras and the final thing to mention which i get a lot of questions about are my pearl hangers these do tend to be sold out a lot on amazon there's only one or two retailers that i found anyway that have the larger sizes so again i'll link them down it's just that sometimes they are sold out beware because all the others are like the 10 centimeter ones they're like little kitty hangers which are cute if you have a little baby you can get you know quite a few of little baby ones but this is the adult size dun, 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 dun. and the final thing which i guess is more miscellaneous or probably would have gone into deco is my saggy my laptop mat i think it's just called a well there you go it's called a multifunctional desk pad now this also came in a ton of colors i got this from amazon and i absolutely love this i can't remember the length that i got i think it was something like i can't even tell you 18 by something or i'll write it all on the screen this is what it looks like so my loves that is the end of today's video thank you for watching coco did so well sitting on my lap the entire time didn't you now if you managed to get to the end of this video please leave the word matt in the comments down below so that i know who my og followers are who are actually getting to the end thank you guys so much for watching take care and i'll see you soon bye